Are those going to end up on the news? I'm not a news person. No, uh, you can email them to the news. Oh, you want you want it on the news? Uh, yeah. All right. What's your name? This is your moment. Oh, no. I don't want to be on the news. <laughs> I want the people to be on the news. All right. I'll try my best. All right. All right. Hey, what happened? I saw it, it started like three hours ago. Why has it taken so long to get it under control? It's too thick for anybody to go in there. We're waiting for a dozer to come in. Really? But it was so small when it oh, started. Yeah, yeah, it was so small, but the problem is, is that with all that thick brush, it's not, uh, we can't really have access to it. Oh, I see. And Are it's, any... It's too hazardous to put any people in there, so we got to rely on the dozer to come in. I see. Are there any homes in danger of, of getting on fire? No, actually, no. Everything seems to be under control, but... The thing is, though, is that that those are coming in right over here. We need uh -huh. to clear this area. They're gonna they're gonna cut a line right through here. So I need you to be able to turn back around and and head out that back that way where you came in. Cause that's All righty. All righty. We'll do. Yeah, here they come right now. It's a big truck behind you. Okay. So, yeah, we're gonna need a team. What's morning. your name? My name is Beto Mendez. Okay. Are you volunteer fireman? Uh, no, I'm an uh, on-call firefighter with the uh, Bureau of Indian Affairs. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Well, Open. thank you so much for your service. Yeah, thank you so much. You're Hope doing a good job. <laughs> All right, I'll try my best. All right. <laughs> just, uh, be careful on your way out because it looks like the dozer boss and the dozer is coming in. All right. We're All about right, to you. leave. Thanks.